Shalom, Shalom, and giving all glory, honor, and praises to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham Rakakadash, double honor to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who grew well, peace and salutation, blessing to the Akim pushing this word of truth and in sincerity, risking your lives and freedom to do so now more so than ever. I'm your fellow servant, Damyadya Mahar. I represent the GMS branch here in Cleveland, here to feed the elect of the nation of Israel, which consists predominantly of you Negroes, Latinos, Native and Seminole Indians, you people of Negro and Indian descent, as well as the Israelite foreigners that scattered throughout the four corners of the earth from among the heathens to you, we say Shalom. Out of one, Ratazah Abanawa, Ratazah is an edifying lesson. <clears throat> I just want to touch on this article from the Atlantic, published two days ago. And um, this is going to be a quick lesson. I'm going to read the title. It says, Vaccine Refusal Will Come at a Cost for All of Us. So basically, if you're anti-vaccination, if you're against getting vac vaccination, and, and I'm going to say this, if you were a smart or wise individual, you would be against this, this vaccine waters. <laughs> because... When you look at the history of Maxine Waters <laughs> and the and the um they you know they got certain funds set up for um you know for side effect and hey man Lord willing this this video don't get flagged or taken down taken down <laughs> all right but um I'm just bringing out this information right vaccine refusal will come at a cost for all of us so they're about to start singling out and ostracizing the individuals that's against getting a vaccine waters and predominantly the individuals that's against this are the individuals that serve and seek after the heavenly father yahweh Hashem, yahweh shah and this prophesied in the scriptures that they was gonna a uh, 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 insurrection against those that fear the lord okay and this is part of that insurrection this is an uprising against this that's what an insurrection is an uprising against a monarch or an authority, and really the authority on the planet Earth are the uh, uh, the, the prophets, starting with the apostles and the elders of, of Great Millstone. Okay, <clears throat> and also the Heavenly Father warned us of these things. All right, the Heavenly well, you know, the Heavenly Father, right? He warned us of these things um, throughout the Scriptures, and in particular in the books of Acts, the fourteenth chapter. This is how the Heavenly Father is going to confirm this confirm the souls of the, 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 the disciples to see if you with him or, or you not with him all right and the lord said through much tribulation shall we enter into the kingdom of heaven so we're gonna have to go through tribulations we're gonna have to you know get over hurdles and obstacles of course we're gonna have yahweh barashim and yahweh to help us so that's a, that's a no-brainer all right but um these things are prophesied to happen. The Lord said that they was going to separate us from their company, man. They did the same thing to the disciples and the, you know, the apostles and prophets of old, man. They did the same thing to them. <clears throat> and these people really think that they're going to be a, doing a good thing, man. All right. But let me read some of this article. Um, it was really a point. I don't want to start at the beginning. Um. Let's just start here. If the 30 percent of Americans who are telling pollsters they won't get vaccinated, follow, follow through the cost of their decisions will pile up. The economy could take longer to get back to full speed. And that's going to have, you know, you know, and that's what these are do. He play on the emotions of the people. He know that they want to get back. So and he's giving you a solution, which is the Maxine water. All right. But, you know, just certain people don't want to basically adhere to that and that's going to cause uh, division that's going to cause tension that's going to cause um, contention it says um, the economy could take longer to get back to full speed and once it does it could get shut down again by outbreaks variants will continue to spread and more people will die each Maxine Water case requires weeks of costly rehabilitation even after the pandemic phase millions of max Maxine Waters refusers could turn into hundreds of thousands of patients who need extra care should they come down with a disease. Their bet that they've outsmarted the thing 
or their insistence that Anthony Fauci or Bill Gates were trying to trick them or not stop them from going to the doctor when you're having trouble breathing, right? Which we ain't going to go to the to the doctors because the Heavenly Father um, can heal. So that's who we go to. And we use natural uh, uh, herbs, natural uh, uh and, and, and all right, that's what the immune system is, is for, is to heal us. All right. I forget what the word immune mean. Forgive me. Uh, In service. Right. That's what the word immune mean in service. So our body is in. It, it heals itself, man. We don't really have to go to the to these uh, physicians of no values in a Frankenstein medicine. You know, so I ain't going to read too much of this. I just want to get a couple of scriptures and I'm going to close out. Uh, I had a couple of scriptures. Let me see. Oh, yeah, I'll just get this in Luke. This Luke 6 and 20. And he lifted up his eyes on his disciples and said, Blessed be ye poor, for yours is the kingdom of heaven. Right? And I got another precept in the book of Second Edges. Right? Um, let's see. Come Because in order to um receive the kingdom of heaven or make it to the kingdom of heaven we got to go through the obstacles that are set before us all right we can't go around we can't go under we got to go through we got to push through second there's just seven and uh this is second edge seven and verse six there is also another thing. A city is built and set upon a broad field and it's full of good of all good things. And that's talking about the kingdom of heaven. They got the series on Netflix called The Good Place. And that's a blasphemous series too, man. And then Edomites going to pay for that. Because they had a thing where Michael messed up and brought some Edomites in the kingdom. And they some some, some uh, heathens in the kingdom. They knew they ain't supposed to be there. But you know, that's neither here nor there. But... This is referring to the kingdom of heaven. It said the entrance thereof is narrow and set in a dangerous place to fall. Like as if there were a fire on the right hand and on the left, a, a deep water. Because we walking through the valley of the shadow of death, man. It's death all around us. All right. Death around every corner. It says, and one path only between them both, even between the fire and the water so small that there could but one man go there at once. If this city now were given unto a man for an inheritance, if he never shall pass the danger set before it, how shall he receive this inheritance? It says, and I said, it is so, Lord. Then said he unto me, even so also is Israel's portion. Right. So that's what we're going to have to go through in order to get, you know, the kingdom. We're going to have to go through dangers. We're going to have to go through situations. All right. Um. Luke 6 and 21. Blessed are ye that hunger now, for ye shall be filled. Blessed are ye that weep now, for ye shall laugh, for ye shall laugh. Right. We hungry now. And we're gonna be filled pretty soon. We weeping now. But we are the Lord said in uh John, I believe is 16 chapter, that our our joy our our, our lamented shall turn to joy, roughly paraphrasing. Blessed are ye when men shall hate you and when they shall separate you from their company. And that's what these red Hebrew Edomites doing, you know, by this vaccine refusal situation, man. They want to separate us from their company, man. All right. They want to uh, 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 cast us out with disdain. Mm -hmm. They want to abhor us. OK. Um, Let me keep going. And then I'm going to close out. Um. Blessed are ye when men shall shall hate you, right? So we blessed when men hate us because obviously we doing something good. We doing something righteous. Why else would individuals hate you? Just like they hated our Lord and uh, Savior, Yahweh Shah. They hated him because the righteous works that he was doing and the, the light that he was shining on their wickedness and them transgressing and breaking the law, okay? So they hated him, so they're going to hate us too. It says, and when they shall separate you from their company and shall reproach you, right? They're going to shame us, right? They're going to start shaming people for, they're going to start shaming the anti-Maxine waters, you know, the anti-Maxine people, man. They're going to start shaming them. In particular, the men, starting with the Apostle Elsa Great Millstone, but the Israelites first and foremost, man. Because it's a lot of Israelites, even the ones outside of the truth, man, that uh, are anti-Maxine waters. So they're going to shame um, these individuals and cast out your name as evil for the son of man's sake. Rejoice ye in that day and leap for joy. 
So we're going to be rejoicing, man. For behold, your reward is great in heaven. For in like manner did their fathers unto the prophets. Right. So they did the same thing in the, in the ancient days, man, to the prophets. All right. Not in particular about this Maxine and giving people, you know, the jabs and the infusions and shit, you know, but, you know, ostracizing the men of the Lord. And this is just a device of Satan that he using to do it, man. All right. He saw he's, he's a cunning. This man is, is, is experienced at, um, <laughs> Uh, 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 mani manipulation. This nigga is, excuse me, this man is a master of manipulation, man. And that's what he gonna do. He gonna manipulate the minds of these uh, 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 these people that's on a low frequency, man. These low level people. He gonna manipulate the minds of these individuals out here and turn them against the men of the Lord. All right. Um, let me see. I had another scripture, I think. Hey, Lord willing, this is edifying, man. Let me get. Um, what was that? Is that Revelation? It is Revelation chapter. Um, uh, is this it? It's Revelation chapter three, verse ten. Because thou, matter of fact, let's see what nine say. It's Revelation chapter three. Yeah, that's the point 10. It said, because thou has kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. Right. So the heavenly father, he's going to, he's going to protect us from these Maxine waters, this infusion, man, and these devils. The heavenly father will protect us because we kept the word of his patience. We kept the law to the best of our ability. We showed brotherly love. Char we were charitable. We fellowship. All right. We believe that Yahweh Shai is the, the, the son of the Most High and that is, he's the savior of the nation of Israel. And we believe the names Yahweh Baha Hashim Yahweh Shai, man. We believe what's written in the scriptures, Old and New Testament, apocryphal included, you know? So, yeah, I, I pray this was edifying. I'm going to put a link. Like I said, this is a lengthy article. I didn't really read the whole thing. I just read a couple paragraphs, you know? Did a little quick lesson. Like I said, I pray this edifying. Give all glory on and praises to Yahweh. Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Kakadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who were well, peace and salutation, blessing to the I can push this word in truth and in sincerity. Shalom. Wafla Baba.